I'm going to show you a game that is just great. Bingo. It's not regular bingo. You can do this with every level um, alphabet or whether you're going to start with your VCE or VC, it doesn't matter. When you download your directions of 15 different games, you will get this a nine square bingo sheet and you're going to get a 25 square bingo sheet. The little ones, the younger children, or the very beginning readers, beginning or people who don't have the confidence yet or need a little more practice, begin with the nine square. You give them the word list. They write the words on the bingo squares in the little boxes. Talk about empowering the child. They decide where the word's going to go. I had a boy once, he was so dysgraphic, dyslexic and dysgraphic. He never said a word, he picked up a pencil he saw writing. I said, I'm not going to look at it. It's yours. By writing, they have to encode. They have to spell it. They have to look at the sequence of the letters. If you ask them, instead of using a marker, just take your pencil and put an X on the word. Then when they have to play again, they have to rewrite it. Some of them go, sure, no, I want to write because I want to do it differently. I didn't do it right. Others go, I don't want to write it again. And that's okay. Know who you're working with and just go along. You can give them a new sheet, write it again. Many of them love doing it. Now, when you say, okay, here's the word toe, T-O-E. And now they're looking if they have it on their bingo sheet. It's a great game. They write it. By writing it, you know they have to process the letters. And you'll know if they usually can write it, they can read it. That's the whole point of this.